In this video, I'm gonna teach you a brand new way for you to find clients this year that nobody is talking about. So with that being said, let us begin. So about five years ago, the most popular method for you to find clients when you wanted to be a video producer for your video production company was actually to go on Facebook. Remember Facebook? Yeah. And you would essentially look at communities in different niches. So for example, you could be in a community for real estate owners, or you could be in a community for fitness influencers or fitness brands. You will join these communities, engage in these communities, and then you would post your videos that you've done in those communities. So if you're a real estate videographer, you would post real estate videos there. For me, it was for e-commerce brands. So I was posting the e-commerce videos or the product videos I was doing at the time to this community. Then one of two things would happen. Either one, somebody would message you and say, hey, look, that's a really cool video. Why don't you work with us? Or two, you can look at the people in the community and you can ask around and see if anybody was willing to work with you. And this was a really good way to get clients back in the day. Now, in 2024, the new way that I think you should be trying out to see if you can get clients this year, and by the way, I only know this because people are doing it to me, is actually by going to a site called School. If you know who Eddie Kamabach is, he's probably one of the many creators who are pushing people to go to a creator and teach them how to create a community to basically sell courses and a coaching program. Prior to him doing this, School was a way for coaches and communities to build in many different niches and have course content and have group calls there. And a lot of them do these things for free. So let me teach you exactly how to find clients in a very simple six step method. Step one is to go to school.com forward slash discovery. In here, you're going to be presented with a whole bunch of different communities. You can even search different niches you're interested in. So if you're a video editor who has previous experience doing stuff for e-commerce, coaches, you can search something like coaches. And here you can see there are hundreds of communities for coaches and a lot of them are free as you can see. You can even go back and go to filter and filter them for free and then you can scroll down. And basically what you want to do is actually find 10 to 15 communities in the niches you're interested in and in places that you potentially have videos that you can post in these communities to show that you're good at what you do. Step two will be to join the communities that are free. You can join pay ones if you want, but I suggest just doing the free ones. <laughs> when you join a community, a lot of the times there's going to be a application process where you have to essentially put your name, put your email address and talk about why you're interested in these communities. I don't want you to just join a bunch of communities and do nothing there because the next step is actually to interact with these communities, actually give value, right? The more you give in life, the more you're going to receive. See this as positive karma if you want to be all woo woo whatever anyways the reason you want to do this is because you want to actually provide value to people in these communities such that when you actually reach out to them they've already received some form of value from you okay now this isn't like a get rich quick thing but if you do this right and you do this well you're going to be able to potentially get some calls from this method with not so much effort to be honest the key component of step three is when you post in these communities, you want to post the following pillars of content. One is actually asking questions about the community. For example, if you're a video creator, video editor, videographer, you can ask questions like, hey guys, what kind of videos are you seeing that are performing the best in X niche? Or you can ask people, what are your biggest struggles when it comes to video content for X niche? The second pillar is going to be a self testimonial, right? So that's gonna be you essentially posting a video that really worked for one of your clients in the community's niche. So let's take real estate, for example. You can post a real estate video that you did for a client that did very well. And you can say, hey guys, check this out. I made this video for a real estate business. It performed really well. I think it was because X, Y, Z. Let me know what you guys think down below. Now, I don't want any call to action in this. Don't say book me for a call. Don't ask for anything, okay? Just post add value. If you repeat this for all these communities, you can be creating content, posting one to two times a week in each of these communities. And you can pretty much do the same ones if you're in multiple real estate communities, for example. Value content. So you're going to essentially give tips and advice to people. For example, say you notice that a lot of coaches are doing those animations, right? Post content saying, hey guys, I noticed that a lot of coaches are doing animation type videos. Here is one that I made. Definitely send it to your editor so that they know that this is currently the meta right now. Almost like, you know, when you're playing Call of Duty, 
and like there's like the best meta loadout right now you can just basically tell your friends and then everybody does it really well but then again like at some point they're gonna have to nerf it so either way the people in these communities are gonna get loads of value from you so much that they might even actually contact you personally but if they don't that's fine we have step number four so step number four is to identify potential clients within these communities by examining their posts and interactions so you might have somebody saying hey i'm getting terrible engagement on instagram you know what do you guys recommend they might do a post like this in fact in school in these communities you can actually search questions on the with the search bar on top you can search for example content video instagram engagement likes views shares saves right the key words that people are going to be talking about and then what you're going to do is find the ones that have problems and then you're going to actually click on their profile and you can direct message them you might even get some more information once you click on their profile and you're able to actually see other posts that they made. Now you want to essentially create a CRM or a document that has all of these people potential leads. By the way, if you want my own leads management CRM, I left it in the description down below. So once you put all these leads into that document, it's time to actually reach out with some DM scripts. Now I've actually, for you, left the DM scripts down below. I made a Notion document about this, so you can actually steal these. But essentially a DM script would be something like, hey, I noticed your presence in X community. I'm curious about how you're currently getting clients with video. Are you open to exploring new ways in, with uh, video content for your social media, etc.? Something along the lines. Just have one to three different scripts that you're going to actually send to them. And then after you send to them, you're gonna wanna make sure that you're actually chasing them for a reply. Why are you running? Why are you running? They might not reply immediately, but if you say, hey, just wondering, is this the right person to speak to? Hey, I'm just wondering, are you still having this kind of issue? That kind of DM sequence is what you want to try and do. Now, once you do this and people start replying to you and get interested, that's when you want to create a Calendly link to send to them so they can book a call with you. And in the call, that's where you're going to sell your services. Most importantly, if I were you, in the call, I'll create like a presentation on Canva for free or something so that you're able to show all the videos that you've created for different clients in that space. If you come prepared to a call with all your videos, you're going to look so professional and your close rates are going to be so much higher than if it was just you sitting there, you know, in front of a webcam, just be like, hey, you want to do videos or what? Look, if you're a video creator that's really stuck trying to get clients, you really want to jump on the freelance ladder and make some money with your passion, you definitely want to check out VP+. Plus. VP+, Plus is a paid community with Jack Cole and myself where we drop absolute bangers of value every single week. We do loads of group calls where myself and Jack and other people can jump in, ask questions. I can help you solve your problem that you probably have in your business. Now, not only that, we have a bunch of course content that in is included in your subscription from an outreach masterclass to how I actually run my own agency to how to run paid ads, which is what we specialize in to the blue path, which is how to actually grow your personal brand on Twitter and loads more values and gems that are coming every single month. VP Plus has top tier talent from experts in sales, experts in in business, in running agencies. We're not just some amateurs that are trying to do something. We've walked the path that you probably want to walk right now. And if you want to do the same thing, then definitely check out VP Plus down below. Okay, so I hope you actually tried this method. The only reason I know about it is because people have actually been doing this to me. I'm in so many communities on school and people are just DMing me doing the same thing. And I was like, you know what? This could be something that us video creators could do. Hope that was useful. If you want to know some skills that you need to acquire to become a more valuable video editor, check this video right here. And with that being said, I will see you in the next one.